update. Welcome, folks. We have the Dow Industrials right now down, trading down uh, 381. We have the NASDAQ off 304. S&Ps are off 70. That's a downdraft, folks, inside the NASDAQ of 2.1%. Uh, 1.1% the S&Ps and 1.1% the Dow Industrials. And you can expect uh, this is going to be a nasty close, folks. Uh, that's the bad news. The good news is if I bring you over to the S&P for a second and take a look at it, what you have here is this. Now, I, don't, I expect lower markets into the close, but I just want to explain something to you. When you do more than a 1 to 1.618 ABC structure down or up, folks, most of the time you get an immediate change of trend. So if we take a look at this S&P, what you're going to see here is that your figure is 43.74, meaning that would be a 1 to 1.618 ABC down. And we've hit 44.03. So I expect what we're going to probably have inside the S&P is that it is going to, without stopping that is, go after the swing lows of October 1st. Um, you take a look at the NDX 100. We've been talking about the... You know, the 350 area, bottom line, we're here. Uh, you're at uh, 354 right now. You hit 353 today. You get a monster expansion of volume. Um, you know, so that this, this game is wide open to get the test, meaning the 350. Gold, gold contract out here. We're trading at a price point of, uh, 13, of 1831. Right now, you're down 10 bucks. $11, uh, you get 210,000 contracts, and that's going to be low contract volume going against its strength. So we're going against, yeah, you're going against 318,000 contracts, and you get 210. And good old King Dollar. We take a look at King Dollar. King Dollar is still trying to make up its mind. It went up to ice, gave it up, but guess what? It's really staying up there again. Um, you're down 92 ticks. You're at 95, 643, bottom line. This can go either way once again. It, this is a, it's a classic thus far. What I mean by that is that you broke down, you come back to ice. Most times, though, you don't stay up here that long. And we're up here four days now. So we'll see where the rest of this is going to shake out. We're going to take a look at the composite, the NASDAQ composite. Now, this is, what's gonna, this is what's also dangerous. The composite blew through the October 4th swing lows like butter. I mean, in a month away, it blew them away. So that's saying we want lower price. Stay right there, folks. Come right back.